Hey friends, I just wanted to share a quick how-to video. I'm in the middle of making tea. <laughs> I have all my herbs everywhere and I'm restocking our tea supply. And um, I just, I grabbed my horsetail out, um, which I have some horsetail in this jar. And horsetail is an amazing herb, but I don't usually make teas with it um, because it's just one of those herbs that like, there's a little bit of cautions around like, oh, should children have it or not? And you really shouldn't be taking it or, or drinking it on a regular basis, um, you know, maybe six weeks at a time, but not really longer than that necessarily. But it is an amazing herb. It's one of the few herbs that pulls silica out of the earth and provides that in a way that our bodies can absorb it easily. And silica is something that helps with skin, hair, nails, teeth enamel. Um, for me specifically, I want to have my horsetail, um, I'm going to make an acetone today, which is basically just horsetail mixed with vinegar um, and or infused in vinegar. And the vinegar is going to draw out the, um, the like all the nutrient value of the herb. And so um, that's going to make it um, where my body can absorb it easily. And I just want to have it for my teeth because um, my dentist was saying, you know, my enamel is just not staying very strong right now. I think it has something to do with how acidic our water is. And um, horsetail can help with that a little bit. So um, that's something that I am making today. And you really, you just fill your jar, clean jar up about three quarters of the way filled with dried herb or it can be, you can have fresh picked herb and just, you need to leave it out to dry for several hours. Um, so it's at least not as wet, but I like to use perfectly dried because then the um, tinctures or acetones or whatever I'm making will last longer. And this will last six months to a year. And I'm just pouring the vinegar in and continuing to pour it in. Oh, I'm gonna run out of vinegar. I might have to, I don't wanna pour the mother in really. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna have to get some more vinegar out and finish filling it. But now I'm gonna use my little stick here. You can use, you know, a knife or whatever you wanna use to um, kind of push the herb into the liquid. And then I'm gonna put a lid on tight, shake it up and put it in my cupboard for about six weeks, shaking it whenever I see it and think of it. And I'll make sure I label it. That's important, label it with the date and what's in it. And then in six weeks, I will have my horsetail acetone that I can just drink a little shot of it every day. And um, that will be helpful, be getting a little bit more silica. In. And it, it actually draws out a lot of different um, minerals from the earth. And so it's really valuable to just kind of provide some of those minerals that we might be lacking. Um, you just don't want to necessarily take it for a long time because it can affect your vitamin b1 levels a little bit so just something to keep in mind but this is my first try of making a acetone with horsetail and i'm sure it'll turn out great but just wanted to share the process with y'all